Hello, today in Unity I'm going to show you how to create free text above gaming objects without having to use the canvas. Now, this is important when you start getting tens or hundreds of game objects. Using all those canvas calls is very taxing on the computer. So mainly how this looks from a high level is you have your game objects, most likely a monster or something, and then you have your child game object underneath it where we'll use the text mesh pro. This allows us to use text without canvas. And this gets controlled via a script. Uh, what we do is just create a reference to it, and then you just update that text from the script as desired. So to demonstrate that here today, I have an empty Unity scene, pretty much a brand new project, and we are going to drag in, or use whatever you want to create uh, your monster or game object. I just dragged in a, a basic image here, so we'll call it generic monster. Then we are going to create an empty child, and then we'll just call this health text, and then we'll add uh, text, mesh pro text. If this is your first time adding it, it might pop up a thing. You need to import TMP. Just go ahead and do that. We want the text centered above our little guy. To see what it looks like, we'll just put in some text there. Um, 100 hit points. It's off to the left right now because how it is justified uh, we can just do center justified so it always appears above the center. And we can confirm that with the, the X position as well being zero. With that set, uh, now we can create our script. So just a new C sharp script. We'll just call this monster controller open that up. Now since we're using the TMP we have to import that as well. I believe it's just the TMP Pro. And then we'll create our reference. So public TMP text health text. We're also going to have um, health display. We'll just set that at 100 to begin with. Now to update the text box, we'll just create a new function called update text boxes. Or update, yeah, text boxes is fine if you have multiple. Um, then we'll simply do health text dot text is equal to the current health as a string. Um, the reason why I don't have an update, which you totally can't have, is that when you start getting so many of these calling the text to change every update cycle may add to some uh, CPU performance. And then how we're going to demonstrate that the health is actually updating, we're just going to add a simple um, on mouse down for damage. Obviously in your game you wouldn't have whatever damage function you have. And then we'll do health down by one. And then we'll do update text boxes. So we know that it took damage, and from the damage we now want to show or update the text that it took damage. So save that. Come back here to our game. So our monster, since I'm using the on mouse down, I have to use the box collider. 2D, obviously you can use whatever function you want, but this is just use the on mouse down shortcut. And then we'll add our monster controller script. It has an empty spot for the health text reference, which we will just grab our health text box, drag it in there. And then we should be good to test this, just checking the main camera. Looks like we should be able to see him. Start the game. And when we click, he takes damage. And that updates that. Clicking off here does nothing, and that updates. And just to show how this scales easily, uh, we can make him into a prefab and then we can just draw as many as we want start the game again and you can see we have unique health bar stats for all the different monsters here thank you and uh, that is all